Hi guys, I'm going to do a short video explaining to you what your braking system is and the importance of uh, keeping maintenance up on the vehicle from the braking system itself. I'll start by pointing out a few of the components. The first thing we have is our brake rotor, which is the round part around here. We have a caliper bracket, which houses our brake pads. The caliper itself, which is the hydraulic portion that squeezes the brake pads in order to stop our car. So here we have the caliper removed, we have our brake pads exposed, and we're going to go over why it's important to lubricate and service our brakes every 24,000 kilometers. The biggest portion we see is the rust that gets built up around the brake pad itself, it starts to tighten the brake pad within its bracket, and stops our braking efficiency and gives us uneven wear on our brake pads. We've taken our brake pad, removed any of the rust that has been holding us in our bracket and stopping our brake efficiency. We've taken all the glazing off the inside of the pad. We've basically made these brake pads look like they were when they came out of the box. We've cleaned out our caliper brackets and the shims that hold our pads. We've taken all of the corrosion from the inside of that. Now we're going to lubricate the brake pads and reinstall them. So we've lubricated the points where our brakes pivot and where our brakes slide in and out of these brackets in order to stop our vehicle. The second part that we need to worry about is these slider pins themselves. These slider pins are what give us the ability to squeeze our brake pads via the brake caliper. This one's not so bad. The one I still have attached to the brake caliper itself is actually quite corroded and tight inside of its bracket. So we're going to have to clean that up and lubricate it as well to have everything function. So we've applied lubrication to our slider pins, reinstalled them in the caliper brackets. Everything is moving nice and freely as it should. We can reassemble the caliper assembly now. Having Another area we want to focus on while servicing the brakes is the hub surface itself. Here we can see the markings where the actual tire will mount to the hub. Once this starts to become corroded, mounting our tire becomes tight and can also cause the tire to loosen off over time. So we want to clean all of the hub surface on the brake rotor before we reach it. So here we have our cleaned hub surface. So I know that my tire tire and wheel and rim is going to go back onto the surface and fit flushly. Uh, I'm going to do a quick lubrication on the hub surface itself with the threads for the wheel lug nuts, as well as a quick paint on top of the caliper. And we're all finished. Our will be a complete brake service. Finished product. Our hub's been lubricated. Our brackets are clean. Our pads are clean. Pads are lubricated inside, back in the bracket, moving freely as they were designed. Our caliper sliders are all nice and lubricated. Everything back together as one piece, we now have an efficiently working brake system.